in this video we are going to create configurable products via csv so we have the csv here these are the skus default attribute all the attributes and the details are there so we are going to import the csv via configurable products okay so let's begin with it so let's uh, first we have made the configurable one and the rest are the simple products okay so we are going to add the attributes of both of them we have see the color attribute and this so we need to add we have an attribute like color product yeah this attribute is color is a sync model this and all so we need to add with the comma the name of the attribute i have the color product and after that name that i have the attribute green then we have the size so i'm putting the size equal to medium okay just i will copy this one and paste it the rest of them okay i make it red over here and make it uh, extra large size mm -hmm. make it caps extra large the same i'm going to change this attribute also make it in blue make sure the attribute name and the value would be this what you have added in the back end small okay i'm going to add this one also medium small large okay white okay these are the attributes that i have already in the back end let me map this okay so size small this and large and this is i guess configurable product so we don't require it okay so these we have already added now we have to put the sku for the configurable product this is the configurable product text and we have this sku these three skus we need to add sku size m color product green sku this 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 so here is sku is 1002 1004 we need to use this and come it over here So first of all we are going to put the SKU We have the SKU this one SKU I'm going to put this this SKU I'm going to put this and the size and the color we have to put again this one SKU okay So I'm putting this one as KU. Okay, these three SKUs I'm putting over here. So let's check what the size and all is there. White and size is L. White. And size is L. Okay next one is this one blue and size is small size is small and this is blue correct next one is this one red and excel red 
and excel okay now we are going to put this in the last row of the sheet of the configurable product yeah this one configurable one I'm going to paste it over here okay size and these are the filterable one okay let's put the images also over here we have the images for the config ripple product yeah this is the base image so I'm just adding some of the images like rename this images base image just put the one one image only small image thumbnail image okay and the swatch image we have put the image also okay let's try to export this image export the csv sorry export let's log in with magento let's check this session expander yeah now go to the cattle uh, now go to the system import select check the data first check I'm going to import this row let's check that product name what it is its name is to this one okay let's flush the cache and reindex system index reindex data okay after that flush the cache also Go to the local host magento to base code. Okay, check the whether the product has the data or not. This is one, so I'm going to check this one. I think there would be the error in the, this file. Let's check the log. 729. Report. That is 79. Let's check what it is. Let's re recompile the data and let's check that.
next command I'm going to save the permissions. Now let's check. Now see the configured product already created. We have the option medium, we have the option blue, we have the Excel size, we have the red. So this is how we can create the configurable products from the product CSV. Thank you for watching.